Hello everyone and welcome back to RimWorld. I am ZL. Play, welcome back to RimWorld Alpha 15C as of last time I checked. And uh, yeah, I'm still getting back in the swing of things. Uh, this is our lovely colony. I did make one little change. Uh, Circa, I know, I think you're probably a guy in real life, but uh, Circa's, our Krika, is now Dragoon. Because Dragoon, somebody made a comment and I wanted to give him a little shout out. Say, hey, thanks for the comment. Thanks. Um, and hopefully not sound too creepy while I did so. Did I accomplish it? Nope. Uh, this was a waste of materials, probably. Or maybe not, because maybe that's not as necessary. Uh, all the sandstone that I put down for, for walling or whatever is just kind of humorous because of that. But I do have some granite, right? I am not super picky when it comes to what it's supposed to be. In here, I think the bill is make stone blocks here. So this will be the one for granite. Just for granite. Um, although I do think that now that I look at the details, I uh, might expand the ingredient radius here. But my uh, goal, if you will, is I wanted to eventually replace things but i feel like i need to start winter proofing here uh and winter proofing means structures and building some stuff here i'm pretty sure right there to connect here and yeah we're gonna go like this to connect things and see if we have enough to kind of go like that We'll uh, start out small. Well, that's sort of small. We're gonna just start off with that project here. Um, I need to check the construction logs, but I believe that Svarda, Svarda, you are warden who has nothing to want to talk to. And Zoo is mercilessly slaughtering the wildlife. Fantastic, storage for winter. Um, oh, Lumi is also getting in on the fun. Yeah, blood and guts, war's head. Anyway, part of me moving around like I do, but I do what I want. You know, my mom? My mom is a lovely lady, though. Stop talking trash. All right. Uh, you kind of notice that I'm building around... Um, oh, another thing, too. Well, that's getting built really quickly. Uh, the pausing is really more so let's uh, do a little bit more planning before I go too nuts. Uh, let's just we'll kind of go like this and establish this as kind of connecting area the sinew of it all and it seems like we have enough granite to make this happen where is a granite right there it's a 54 uh this is a very hard uh rock it's saying basically uh beautiful to sculpt known for being easy to sculpt that's interesting i didn't really think about that i suppose that granite making or granite stone breaking is probably the ideal choice for stuff. Also, now that I'm gonna have an excess of power uh, by quite a bit, uh, I think I'm going to uh, work on actually getting people some light up in their rooms. So, um, the granite's still there. People are just sleeping because they're being good in their sleep timers. We're due for an attack or something fun to be coming up here. Uh, once again, I still don't know why you're so wonky to me. Like, are, is this, like, not, like, fully connected or something? Hmm. I don't know. I'll try going like that. And maybe that's... that's the, Actually, that is the reason, I guess, why? Maybe it got blown up? I have no idea. I'm not entirely sure. Caribou Revenge didn't matter because we shot it down. Uh, this, these are granite, too, aren't they? Yeah, they're granite. Uh, what's my ingredient radius here? And also, who was our primary uh, crafter? Uh, one of three can't do it. It's gonna have to be Dragoon, and he was do busy doing some growing. Oh, uh, he's also our cook. Ooh, uh, Yukio, because I think you've tailored everything we need to tailor, right? Has everyone got themselves a beanie? Yeah, they're ready for they're ready for winter. So, I don't think there's any more bills, right? There's no more bills. So, when it comes down to this, these areas are ready to go. We'll keep making some granite for our wall. That's already done. Now, isn't that lovely? 
Um, okay, now the important thing to do is while we're building this whole sort of thing, because what I'm trying to kind of do, at least at the moment, is weatherproof, like I was saying, which I may not have to do this as hard as I have been doing it. I can kind of do something along the lines of just this will connect that and then here now what's important is that if I'm trying to build roofs and I'm gonna have to be controlling heat a heater is only gonna go through so far and if we have a particularly cold winter or it's cold snap like we currently have rolling in fall imagine what that cold snap would be like in winter uh, we're gonna have to make some connecting rooms alongside it now the geothermal generator funny enough actually provides a fair amount of uh, but a bit of a heat uh, within itself which leads me to think that uh, okay well let's the granite blocks for that for that um, we have enough to probably just have it be granite blocks too assuming he's okay he was working at this one and um, stuff's getting done uh, wooden sculptor's table for stone. Oh, oh, okay. For stone blocks, I just realized that. Make you know what? If someone goes and uses that, that's great. This area here is also prime real estate for either we break down this wall or we're gonna have to put a heater in here um, in order to help keep people warm. Um, but I want to make sure we have some connective stuff because uh, if not, the roofs are gonna collapse. Uh, our granite supplies are still kind of okay-ish. It's, it's kind of hard to get a beat on it. I kind of have this this idea, though, that I want to uh, look at my structure no, furniture. Sun lamp. Sun lamp gives approximately like so. Or well, that kind of seems to fit pretty well, doesn't it? So we could even have this here be, um, oh, it's funny, before that gets made, that, the thing that Eve is heading right towards, let's change that to a granite door, shall we? Thank you. Um, but the idea is that I think that we're gonna consider putting a sun lamp. Um, yeah, this is gonna be maximized most space. We can always dig out a little bit in here um, or so. And why I'm doing that is I think I'm just going to be making this whole area. Hey! Oh, okay. So if it's like that, it's going to be one up from this area. So basically from like the midpoint of the generator, I want to thank the wall. So midpoint of the generator. And I'm trying to give enough little kind of connective areas uh, in here. And yeah, auto doors would probably make my life a lot easier. Also, we need to have um, an escape area. Am I using the right stuff? Is this granite? Yeah, it's the granite door. It just, it just doesn't look like it, does it? Um, okay, some along those lines. Um, so we put that together. The granite supply is going okay. Because eventually we want all the sort of stuff to be going here. Slaughter to the, slaughter to the make, door to go. All right, good, good, good. Um, destruction failed. Boo! One of three. You've let me down. Um, now, the thing about this is that uh, I'm, I'm kind of doing the whole open thing, even though I think, in fact, one of three I think is kind of going a little hard in construction when research is more important. Where's one? get stuff done but I, I need that research if you don't research you're not moving forward and like I said uh, we can work this out um, for the zoning areas we're going to want to expand build roof area um, at the moment let's we're gonna have it be some more along the lines of like so start with that okay going through that uh, we can also uh, look into what we kind of have here 
any ideas that this, you know, it's kind of, a, it's kind of a big room, but you know, at least it won't whine, right? No, uh, they will still whine. Who am I kidding? These aren't my colonists. I'm a whiner. Why shouldn't they? It's their right to. Um, I got these kind of neat little hallways kind of set up at the moment. I kind of dig it. This tree's gonna have to go though, even if it's not 100% grown. Uh, all trees in this area, even if they're not grown, should go away. Okay. Um, now that the sun lamp is here, growing area zone is going to be in here, basically in here. Uh, you know what? We'll figure it out. Uh, we'll figure it will, the sun lamp will figure it out. I just re I just realized that some of this isn't growable stuff kind of negating a little bit of my choice on how I built things here. Uh, also, that wall is going to have to go there. Uh, but let's before I forget. Oh, no. Are these two separate? Oh, they're all kind of separate. Ew. Whatever. Not down in the world. Um, I don't know if, that's, if that dog's going to hunt, but we'll basically are going to be making it hay grass. Hay grass. Um, in this area. You know, Hydroponics eventually kind of make it decent, but the idea is that we're going to try to get our cows to uh, live through winter. We're going to want to make sure that uh, they get themselves. Oh, yeah. There we go. That ought to help. Okay. And the reason why I'm doing kind of these connective things the coal sap is over. Hurrah! Now, what I'm curious about it is that. Wait, they're resting? What? Why would they be resting? I don't... Am I resting in the soil? Like, are we using like, proper farm, farm like, uh, ideas here? Okay, explore that. Make door. You have a cut down, thanks. Okay, going in there. One of three is going on this. I still feel a heck of a lot more comfortable. There we go. Okay. Now it's growing. Okay. I wasn't really getting the whole resting thing. Um, this is like taking a long time to make this darn door. Even it's just really that, that bad construction. Um, but, so the idea behind all of this and I have to see, because uh, I thought these got so my number one farmers, I thought would be laying some hay grass by now. Is because I is construction above them on their list? Not, not really. Oh, see, look, some of the roofing just happened. Expands. Oh, look at that. Okay, yeah, they've decided they're going the roof at all. Uh, okay, now see, this is where we got a little bit of the problem. It, they're basically I think what they're basically trying to tell me here is that if I leave things currently as they are um, This will be um, Not comfortable in terms of a uh, It's gonna be like I'm gonna make it that roof area here, but just so I don't want it to break down we're gonna have to consider breaking or splitting this up into an area into itself, maybe? And I don't know if I have to build around it, or that build across it. Build across it. And make some stuff in there. Make some cool rooms in there. Let's, let's just try to... I, th I feel like we have it, so let's just go for it. And we'll put a room here and we've I love how we have this one bed in here it's just kind of chilling and that could be another bedroom but hopefully this will allow so it's not too big of an area that's going to make it impossible okay i'm back you guys probably noticed that you just saw an autosave go by and now they're back at the autosave uh basically i had things crash on my computer so mm, not so good so, uh, left with this predicament of pretty much having to redo what I just did, 
um, a good part of the episode, basically the whole darn flipping episode. But it certainly makes me laugh out loud because it was like, really? Really, guys? Um, but hey, that's the way it goes sometimes you know, when you're playing uh, the game of uh, the most dangerous of games. Now, now that we basically, the thing is that what we've worked on, and I have to actually look and see, um, I'm trying to, and I'm just kind of slowing down for a second because, yeah, oh yeah, clear the build roof area because what, why? That is, I don't know why. Uh, we built the roof over uh, that whole sort of thing. Um, basically, I think one thing I did before I started the video, because it's hard, sometimes I always forget, I started, like, I, like, clicked, like, to go pick up this one, uh, ram to, like, go slaughter. Uh, but basically, we are building and we're moving things, and I really hate going off autosaves, because it makes me look like a dishonest son of a gun. Um, but I have to think of the future and what things might entail. Minor break risk, well, that went away. People are happier. Um, looks like we're building walls, we're making the future happen, um, research is going along as well. What I am lacking is in defense, um, because if you really think about it, I've got the defense that was necessary to build up for here um, going. Uh, this is helpful, and we do need to do our outer perimeter walls. I was really interested in making this, uh, but now I feel like the rest of this area I can start worrying about heating when that becomes a concern um, but we do need to provide more protection it's just a question of how far out do we want to go um, because we have kind of already building the turrets that we did kind of forced to have to build the turrets we did we kind of had things built here although I do like how they have to slow down quite a bit at this area so this can be a nice little murder uh, junction for them if you will um, and we have to think about security amongst all areas. The good thing is, is that I think we got power to spare. So let's look into our security and where do we want... Oh, hydroponics. Sweet. Okay, cool. I always got to pause after this. Um, ba -da -ba -da -bum 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 -bum. <sighs> Drug production. That's the name of the game, isn't it? Um, yeah. And also... Uh, looking into the hydroponics. I have to see what the hydroponics require. Um, hydroponics basin. Steel and a component. Cuts grows patently quickly and artificial nutrient bath requires power to work. Plants will die of power of cuts. Uh, do you still need sunlight? I always kind of forget that part. I'm assuming they need, all plants need sunlight. But it's an artificial nutrient bat. Whatever. Uh, it's one of those sort of things to where I feel like uh, if, if you think about... Oh, they're like this long. I never see... My, my time, I didn't spend too much time working on this. We could kind of have something along the lines of in here. Nothing's really kind of built 100% around it. Um, I'll worry about that a little later. I think right now security is my number one thing that's kind of popping to mind. Because we got stuff that people are going to want to take at this point. Um, so, we're going to continue with our idea. Uh, we can go... We saw how far those turrets reached out. So the swamp can still be our friend uh, here. And go... Yeah, see? Look, we have a natural area that they can't get through. So we can do something along the lines of, or not deconstruct, how about cancel? How about we cancel everything along here? And then that would make us need to have something similar here-ish on the lines. And, it, and some of the stuff I'm doing right now, straight up stealing it. Um, let's cancel one here yeah uh, I'm sort of stealing it from a, another youtuber that I was watching some of the stuff they're doing and I liked what they were doing I liked it I said I want some more of it so um, that's gonna make this northern area uh, at least have some defenses right now some defenses are better than no defenses and that because that's currently what we're holding on to uh, this here is another geothermal that we're probably gonna want to exploit 
So I'm thinking that the next perimeter wall we're going to want to consider is going to be along the lines of... I'm not going to be cutting into the mountains. I mean, this, if they come from this direction, they get slowed down by the water in here and the mud. We already have part of the wall kind of built here, right? So we could do an entrance way along the lines of here. I can even deconstruct um, some of this. Kind of as well one entryway, don't we? Yeah, let's go like this. And from there, uh, because we got the swamp working for us, cut through there. something along those lines uh let's deconstruct i have to claim it first guess not okay and let's cancel here and see what a turret along these lines is going to do security wise so i want if i want to take advantage of the swamp here and be in lines of having a turret around there when they're slowed up to fire around maybe I want this wall to be built up further it's gonna slow them up we should use that to our advantage so we, we have even more real estate than I thought if I really think about it so we're gonna cancel what I just said Boop, ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. And do, do, do. please bear with me. It's also late at night. It's one of those things where it's like I'm 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 doing my best. I'm trying my best here uh, to make sure that I take that. Um, it's a slate wall. I just realized too. But whatever. I'll make part of it off slate, whenever it's necessary. But let's take advantage of what we have. And what we have here is actually maybe i won't just um deconstruct it at all if you consider here yeah something like that right then yeah we got ourselves a nice little place where we can shoot people from they got little to no cover along the lines of this I believe this is far enough away to work. I might cancel this deconstruct order completely. Uh, cancel. Let's just get the cancel tool up. Blip, blip, blip. Working slow. Ah, well. Almost. Ah, what did I tell you here? Deconstruct. No. Cancel it. Okay. Oh, it's because I'm just still on the block. Okay, so, uh, making sure I'm on my way. We got here, we got this, and if that is going to provide them the quickest means here, it doesn't mean that some of them aren't getting as smart and try to tunnel through my area, but even if they do, they should be running into turrets here along this area, and I'm assuming people are coming from the top. I maybe want to cut this down a little bit, but we'll see about that. We'll see about that. Um, using the wall that we already have, and we just make something along the lines of this. Let's just kind of get that done here. Um, this is nowhere near complete, although I have to imagine using the swamp once again to our advantage here a, a quick and easy uh cut off is something along the lines of this down along those lines and i probably would go and want to mine out uh at least that all of it. I mean, I can get some jade out of it. And the idea is that from there, if they're coming from that location, and then we can get some security turrets. We still have some more area to expand. 
from that area. And right now we're just gonna uh, worry about, like right now we're just gonna, like I'm gonna place this down, but I'm gonna go along those lines. Uh, I'll build a copy, right? Um, and I will build it along the lines of here. This is being, yeah, it's being, it's grand, it's okay. Um, because that will provide adequate to this to be able to get some firing lines along those lines. We have at least one turret here, it's not great. Uh, I'll worry about building the rest of the defenses along there, but we have a nice little, you know, something along the line so we can use a swamp again to our advantage. Um, and yeah, trying to use the train to my advantage is kind of a new concept to me, but let's get them working. Enough of this pause BS, huh? Um, everyone's kind of doing their jobs, taking their time, seeing how it is. Uh, it's a matter of that and that at least getting some preliminary defenses up. Um, also, the idea of sandbags. Uh, our steel isn't wonderful. It could be a lot better, especially for... Oh, crap. All right, so we got an eclipse. That's something to worry about. Uh, a loner from the Bluebridge people. Oh, his name is... Uh, the the Bluebridge people are our friends, right? They are. They sure are, buddy. Um, hi. What's up, Lax? Are you like so amazing that I want to steal you? Steadfast, cold tolerant, mmm, pessimist. Yeah, no, that's not what you're not worse. You're not hell in a Troy, we're not starting a war over you. But, um, ba 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 ba. So we have the idea for the basics along the lines here. Because we need constructors, we also need people who are crafting. Uh, more crafters, and I still have to make sure research is going on. Um, I think. What did I say I was going for next? Oh, drug production. Yeah, because it seemed like we're getting smoke leaf, right? Let's use it. Um, gotta get that smoke leaf. Um, is that my crafting spot? Can I? No, because I'm just getting. They're just gonna be making joints all day. Um, I mean, I know they have chemical interests in all this, but uh, this is ridiculous. Okay. All right. Looks like I was right. Prepare defense or attack them preemptively. Oh, okay, okay. So as you can see, that is approximately a flip ton of tribes people. And yep, we might have an extra fighter if uh, what's his name of the Lonely River Lax decides to get uh, involved in this combat. But what we got here is, you see, I prepared defenses along those other lines, and they are happening here. Now, what I'm thinking is the turrets here, we have trees for some protection. I believe that Lumi, our sniper, can go here, um, can go down the road a little bit, and probably pick off a couple of targets. How close are they gonna circulate towards us? The question. How much close are they gonna get? Oh. Let's see. Is that where they're gonna camp? They're gonna camp there. Of course, to be there. All right. Let's check and see. Ah, I see we're losing some line of sight here. Target too far away. There. Ooh. That started horn is on us up. Okay. Yep. See, they're kind of, they're, it's like, that's not all of them uh, and such, but it's enough of them. Got a shot? I do have a shot. Fire. Not enough of one. Still going, going, going. Nope. All right. We'll try here. 
Nope. Problem is, it's like you, it's like you want to try to pick. Oh, okay. Trobo and Finch are feeling like they want some. And well, for all of my silliness, it didn't really mean a whole hill of beans. So we got to get ourselves prepared uh, defensively. So that means that we need to get across the line here. Um, okay. You're running, right? Yeah, okay, good. Be running. That'll slow him down. The rest of our troops have got to get ready. Doo -doo -doo. Okay. You are ready to go, although I believe Sforty is a non violent uh, soul here. And. You need to be part of the fun here. You need not be part of the fun. Good stuff, but I make sure Lumi is crossing over here. We do have a turret on our side, so yeah. It's funny. It's like she get a shot off before and be able to fire again. Boom! Oh, now that's what you like to see, Lumi. Lumi, run away faster than that. Okay. Now, uh, we got ourselves a handy dandy position here and here, and we can fall back from areas as well. Because Finch is going to be encountering a turret. Oh, yeah. No, oh, he's, he's not protected on this side. So. How do you like them apples? Okay. Uh, Lumi is going to... Because right now you're going after her melee style. Okay. So we're going to have Lumi fall back. Uh, yeah, just keep falling back, I think. Say fall back to here. The turrets. Oh! Man, you're eating some shots here. The minigun's fantastic. But we're gonna have to let some of the turrets do the work. We've, how many we got down? We got a couple down at this point. Alright, let's uh, redistribute across the line. He's toast. Drug burning. Okay. Burning him at the campfire. What? What the fun? Where's the fun in that? This is camp. Drugs are bad. Okay. Yeah. You know, not camp killjoy. All right. Uh... How bad is this hit? He's bleeding a lot. We need to get the turret to do more work. It's gonna probably hurt. Yeah, we gotta all fall back. It's a start. Okay. And Okay. Come on, turret. Okay. Looks like you're up for melee attack. In Uh you've been knocked Oh wow, another Krika. <laughs> Second you name somebody else. 
Um... There's just a lot of folks. Yeah, beat him up. Beat him up with the wolf. Come on. Oh! Golly. G Willikers. Damn it. Friendly, friendlies, friendlies. I forgot about that. Forgot about that. Okay. Yeah, that ripped us up pretty good. Fall back, fall back. Oh. Giving you a minigun is not doing great things for my Geo Power Thermal Generator. It just isn't. It just isn't. And my animals as well. Um, I need you, I need my animals to run the frick away. We've got a lot of hurt people here. But, yeah. Run, 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 run. Okay. Or not. Oof. Okay. Man. That is not in our best interest. Um, the way things are going. Uh, that Geo for the power thermal generator is just not looking like it's going to make it when we do it this way. Um, this turret's within range, just getting some work done. It's just taking a while. Uh, I'm just reluctant. It's like, eh, if I have to rebuild it, I have to rebuild it, I suppose. Is the philosophy I should be taking. And they can't reach him. But he should definitely not be targeting that. He should be targeting this area. And we'll try to do some more sniping out of here. Minor break risk. Uh, yeah, your war is over. Let's get you inside. Same with you. You guys, the mini, my, those, our own miniguns are going to be a big problem there. Ooh. Oh, gosh. Hello, cow. Ah, grand. Well, hmm. Zoo isn't even getting anything done here. Um, oh, okay, we got someone down. Let's rescue. We don't want to lose yet. Okay. That is a... We need to fall back. Fall back, everyone. I'm not sure how that... How did that happen? Oh. There's probably a story to that one. Anyway. Um... <laughs> but... Uh, oh, yeah. I don't know. I, I had a visitor, but was that in this one or not? Okay, you guys need to take care of yourselves. Although we might have some close combat on our hands. So, what I think is... Is this war done for... Okay, that's a good hit. That's all hit. How bad is your health? It's not great. Too many. Fall back. They can have to come in there and pay for the land dearly. Ugh, come on. One of three at his minigun stood against the many. Uh, Sorda's just being Sorda. Um, it's gonna provide some cover. This is the easy, this is our fastest way in. Okay. Cleaning dirt. Now you need to. Uh, yeah, we need to change some things into uh, medical. We need to go rest in that. Do they have a way to get to that? Oh god, I have to go through a lot. Oh well. Alright, so we got ourselves a situation here. Uh oh, 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 it's because our leth our uh our animal took care of it there. Okay, so here's my thinking. Uh one Florida. Um that's not gonna work for me. I need you to go in there. Okay, and we're going to restrict you to 
Was forward at the home at the moment, at the very least. So she can't go out there. Um, we can make it so that as soon as we can make it so that if they do break this in, we go like this. One of three makes a good stand here. Uh, Sorta could be undrafted, but she has to stay in, in the home area. Oh, they're leaving. What drove them off finally? I think our animals did. Some of them are still attacking. Oh, no, those are... Wait. Those are... Good trading people. Well, Shazbot. So no, we're, we're not out of this yet. To say the least. Darn it. Okay, Lumi's laid up. Zoo. Uh, Eva, I need you to rest to heal. She's, she's going to do that. She's taking the, the most interesting, interesting of paths. Okay. Now this is a granite door. This is going to take a while to take care of here. And our animals here uh, are... Either we're going to have to get them to come in the home area um, in order to protect them, or they are necessary sacrifices upon the altar of freedom. Mm, I don't think that's a good idea. Okay, so... Yes. The animal area needs to be changed. And then... Okay. So we're going to change run... Or... Uh, we'll just create a new bloody area. Uh, darn it. Change areas. Uh, animal area. Oh, shoot. New animal area. Rename. Uh, run. No, you know what? We can just do home. We can just do home. But we'll call this run two, um, for the future. But we'll get everyone... We'll get them all home. If they can make it in. We're gonna have to be ready for some uh, good old combat once they do enter. They might get bored eventually. I'm hoping. Uh, sorry. I think that's our. Are they? Oh, devastation! Devastation! No! Darn it. Gemini's out there too. These are just so man. Hill, hill, hill tribes are, or just uh, these guys are just dangerous hombres, no matter how you put it. Um, the only thing I can think of is where do we need to? I mean, this power switch is will be a blow. I mean, we could grab grenades. We still have fighting power. I mean, we're we're not out of this yet. Um, and we can make them pay very dearly for anything that they do come in, um, to fight. Yeah. So maybe holding that open is not what I want to do. Okay, and we'll go through here. Okay, but they're going to be fighting through that. And, oh, fortunate am I. I believe we've been given a second lease. I hope, I really hope you get inside here. But they're going around this way. Um, I'd love to get some stretcher bearers out there for our people um, and such. But it's just not the best of plans um, at this point. How bad are you bleeding, buddy? Oh, look, she's just repairing the door from this side. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Um, and this ought to be enough to drive them away. If they're going through the mud, they got two turrets to contend with. Come on. And... Oh, okay, they're, they're fleeing. Okay, they're fleeing. Okay. They are fleeing. Okay, 
so we are gonna need to uh is it worth it to be going after any of them don't think so so basically we gotta get people to rest and um turret might get somebody nope doesn't look like it just one person shy okay so now we gotta really look at our stuff hard our best uh our best doctor is one of three uh does that mean that how much blood he's lost? He's bleeding. He's barely bleeding. Okay, so it's more like they're health bars. So if we really look at it, um, our number one person. Yeah, I know he wants to play doctor, but um, I need him to rest. Which one is his bed? I don't know what his bed is. Um, see, we're just a little too early in the game for hospitals. Tending to Elvira. I appreciate that. I do. But you are you are the number one. Uh, I gotta save you if I can. You sleep here. Where do you sleep? Whatever. Change this to some medical bed and get in it, because we gotta we gotta get you healed up first. And our number two doctor is that's always good. It's Florida. Um. Okay. One of three's medical needs are. It's. Hopefully you won't lose the arm. But we have to use, if we, ha if we have medicine available, we got lots of medicine. We probably won't use 10 medicine unless we get infections. So it's like, the one thing is like, so we'd like to just kind of go through here, go through all of our characters, make sure that they're not on um, like non-treatment or something when they're like prisoners. Okay. And Florida, first thing you were gonna do is tend to our wounded. Good, and we got a lot of it. So you, yeah, we gotta patch him up as soon as possible. Uh, yeah, Zoo can't. Lumi is incapacitated. We're gonna lose Yukio. In fact, I believe we're gonna have to go treat you. Yukio, he's our more valuable guy. Um, and how bad are you at bandit singing? You can apply a bandage. That's, yeah. Can you not? Are you, oh, did I not highlight him as doctor at all? I gave her at least the ability doctor, didn't I? Only who can't is Zoo. What? Some of them are still trying to get in? That's interesting. Because like right now, believe me, I want to go save the animals too. I'm feeling I'm feeling that. But uh I can't. They're coming in to break into and steal our stuff. That's not cool, man. Uh I could bomb my own freezer with anyone who's still got some breath. Um, I can have them equip grenades and throw them at our own freezer to attempt to uh, hurt them. Are they trying to like br to retreat by going this way? Oh no, they just broke it to be a dick. That's good. Alright, anyway. Uh, we're, it's very touch to go right now. Whew. Can you feel the suspense? It's in the air. Definitely a long episode, I know, but that was a heck of a thing that we had to do. And this is going a little too slow. I'm afraid that we're going to lose people like Eva, because if you look at our combat thing, um, and you see, yeah, the minigun is awesomely able to get your own guys killed. One of three could potentially lose his arm. Okay. Treater. You go bionic if not. Oh no. Oh he's oh now she's oh gonna go rest the medical bed? How much did you get healed up? <sighs> that was stupid. Uh
in the streamer. Okay. One of three is making himself. This is a very tense moment at the, right right now. Uh, Zoo, you're not dead. Try to save devastation. Okay, animal beds are just more of a in something in your mind, really. Uh, there, it's it, don't get me wrong. Animal sleeping spots. Uh, yeah, this sounds good. How about right here? There you go. Those look great to me. Um, you're not you're not dying to me yet. Devastation has been through too much. Plus, his name is Devastation, or her name. Excuse me. Okay. Not having a thing out here is no. No. Maybe I'll get to her in time. You can attack Zoo instead. Uh oh. Well. Well, whatever. If it works, it works. Okay. Yeah, one of three is losing some blood to go do this. He's definitely paying for this. You're, you're eating my stuff, right? Uh, Lumi can it can walk. If Lumi can walk, then Lumi can treat. Dragoon? Okay. Lumi is going to go rest over here. Okay. And how bad are you? Bad back, cuts, bleeding at this. Dragoon's in a worse position you are. Oh, it's rotting away that quickly? All because the door opened? I put it... Oh, why did I put that out there? Shoot. You're moving. It's incredibly poor. Efficiency is 18%. Yeah. Uh, it is what it is. Can you, how about we delete this bed? I mean, they're somewhat healing, but can I risk, like, to another bed? We'll never do doctoring, <laughs> just never. It's against what he believes in. There we go. And I think that that means I can rescue, try to devastation again. This might all be a fool's errand. And this is really tough to see. Okay. Okay. Splutter that. Don't harvest a smoke leaf plant. I need you to tend to uh, devastation. No, you need to go. You are in bad shape, pal. I needed you to stem off the tide here. Um, but as soon as hey, Lumi's terrible at this, Florida. How bad? It, how, I mean, I'm just trying to do a basic patchwork job here. But one of three really needs to help. Okay, I know you're really, really moving crap. But, yeah, treating. Okay. Yeah, build your art. How about the of sadness? Okay. Yep. And this is what happens. But we have the medicine. We have the medicine. So, triage is currently in effect. Zoo is perfectly healthy. We're going to attempt to rescue Nelly. Okay, and then we will attempt to rescue uh, Gemini. I don't see any of these guys for prisoners. I think they all died. Um, I do think that I have a timber wolf hunting Shin inside my own darn base. <laughs> well, isn't that going to be fun to clear out? Um, 
Okay. We lost Nelly and Gemini. Those are both pets. It hurts, but it is what it is. Devastation is still kicking, <laughs> even though he doesn't have an eye. And it just isn't great. Um, uh, and we have a wolf inside our freezer. Okay, so... <laughs> tune in for a very special next episode of Grey's Anatomy, whatever this game I'm playing is. Grey's Anatomy, the board game. Um, so, to recap, that was a very difficult uh, dealing with the tribes, people. And I, my instincts were correct about, uh, dear God, we need to make sure that we're good here. Uh, as one of these things is like I'm checking here. Yeah, okay, so we have some connection to the grid um, going on here. Uh, he's going to go smoke a joint. Okay, Zoo's going to smoke one. <laughs> it will help with the pain for some of these people. Uh, but we're going to have to be doing a lot of work to keep our people alive. So it's going to be definitely a little bit of triage next episode. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, appreciate it very much. And I hope you guys all learned a little something about how much tribe men make you mad. And how it's really got to get a pretty much a kind of a better uh, defense situation than this. But dang, if we did not take out a lot of people. And at the moment... Our people are currently alive. We'll assess our damage next time. So thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. It helps out immensely. And I will catch you guys in the next episode. Take care now. See you then.